everyone. So I just got back from watching Catching Fire. I loved it and I had to recreate this look that Katniss was wearing at the Presidential Palace during the movie. Mine leans a little bit more orange so I think it's a little more wearable. So let's go. This is my Catching Fire inspired makeup look. So I'm starting off with this rose gold cream eyeshadow and this is from a Revlon quad and I'm going to put all of the exact names of all the products down in the description below so check that out. So I'm going to apply that all over the lid as a base and then I'm going to use this orange eyeshadow. This is from a Wet n Wild trio and I'm going to put that in my inner corner about halfway up my lid. Now I'm taking this champagne pigment from NYC and I'm going to put this kind of in my inner corner but going up that eye socket bone, I guess you could say, all the way up to my brow. Now here I'm taking this satin red wine color and you can always grab a brighter red for that true Katniss look but like I said I wanted a little bit more of a wearable look so I'm uh, using this red I'm putting it on the remainder of my lid and I'm also going to be blending this up towards my brow bone. So I'm switching to a blending brush and I'm going to blend that almost all the way up to my brow because that's how Katniss had it in the movie. Now I'm taking a gold cream eyeshadow and a thin liner brush and I'm going to be dabbing this on right under my brow bone and at the top of my eye socket for a little bit more shimmer. I'm taking a matte white and I'm going to be putting that right underneath where I blended out the red color and kind of elongating my lower lash line with the white. So I felt like a felt tip liquid liner was perfect for this job so what I'm going to do is I'm drawing a very thin line on my upper lash line and I'm going to do um, a skinny winged out liner. Now here was the hard part for me. I lined my bottom lash line with the same liquid liner and then we're going to bring that out and kind of do a bottom winged liner and they do not connect if you look really closely in the movie. You're going to want a lengthening mascara for this look or you could use falsies. I'm actually going to do both just for the sake of the video. So I'm putting on this Avon Super Extend Mascara. And now I'm applying my falsies and these are actually Katy Perry reusable falsies. blend my lashes and the falsies together by adding a little bit more mascara. So the eyes are done, let's move on to the face. So I'm going to take a light bronzer and they did something interesting with Katniss's cheeks and contouring for this movie, at least for the capital scenes. They brought most of the contouring kind of lower than you would expect on the face. So as you can see with the blush, I'm actually going to put this in the hollows of my cheeks as well on top of that bronzer. And then on the apples of the cheeks is where I'm going to put my highlighter. And uh, this is how they had it in the movie. I guess you can't expect anything less from capital trends. color which is only a little bit darker than my own lip color. I'm going to apply that pretty lightly. And that is it. We've been transformed into Katniss. There were so many cool makeup looks during this movie. I kind of just want to do them all. And like I said, I kind of made this look a little bit more wearable, but you can definitely intensify it and really channel your inner capital fashionista. Hope you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe.